When ordering wheels, especially custom billet wheels, you have a lot of options. Right here, we're looking at a 20 by 10 Hot Rods by Boyd BOF wheel with a brushed and polished and clear coated finish. Your standard finish is always gonna be all polished. So as you can see, like I mentioned, this one has optional finishes. So it's really, there's a couple different styles of wheels. All your custom built billet wheels are gonna be a two piece. You'll see the welded center in here and that's basically how they adjust the backspace and get it fit to your vehicle. So that's where we step in and say, hey, we, we know what works. Don't worry about wondering if you measured right. This one's actually gonna go on one of our project vehicles, the 64 Suburban. The reason we got the brake out here, because that plays an important role when ordering wheels. Your caliper offset, make sure it doesn't hit the spokes. It can change the track width. So that's where we really need to know what brakes you're running. If you don't have brakes, we need to know what you plan to run, because you don't want to order a wheel for a brake system that you might go with and then go bigger, and we have some interference issues. So really just putting together a game plan and making sure that everything's going to work once we get you set up. A most common question we get is what's the difference between a two-piece wheel and a one-piece wheel? Here you have a two-piece wheel, and like I mentioned earlier, it's gonna be welded. So that center can be welded anywhere within the outer, and that's where you get that adjustability, can fit any car you want, essentially. The one-piece wheel is gonna be exactly that, just one piece. We can't change the center. It's all one piece. The backspace is what the backspace is. It's generally made to fit most cars. If you have an odd application or big brakes or just isn't what this was intended for in terms of what the backspace is, you might have to run a spacer or it might just stick out too far or just altogether not fit. So that's where you really have some flexibility with the two-piece wheel. They do run more because it's gonna be a forge center. There are some cast centers out there, um, but the reason it runs more is because that forge center and they're all built in the US. Mostly your one-piece wheels are gonna come overseas, so that's where you're gonna see a lot more inexpensive wheel. So depending on which route you wanna go, we can help you choose and see which one will work best for you based on what kind of car or truck you have and what diameters and widths and backspace you want. There might be a good option in a one-piece wheel. So whatever you decide, we can help you choose what'll work best for your application. Secondly, the other question we get a lot is, what is the difference between a standard profile wheel, like you see here in the Hot Rods by Boyd, or the concave, which this is the Bose here. So a lot of manufacturers will make both standard profile and concave. Hot Rods by Boyd does concave and standard. Same with Bose and Shot and all of them. So on a standard profile, it's gonna be more straight up and down, like on this Hot Rods by Boyd wheel. Then looking at the Bose wheel on the concave, it's gonna curve out, eating more wheel lip. So it's kind of a catch-22 because you do, you do get that deeper look with the concave wheel, but it eats up your wheel lip. So if you can imagine, if this was a concave wheel here, same back stays, same spec, same everything, that center would actually come out and you would have less wheel lip than you see here. So there is a give and take. You get the look, but you gotta give up that, that wheel lip, unless you're going with a real wide wheel, real narrowed axle. So some applications you can have your cake and eat it too. But in most, you're gonna have to give up one to get the other. Here we're looking at the same wheel, same design. This one's a 22 inch, this one's a 20. This one has the charcoal ceramic center. This one's brushed and polished. So you can see how just changing the finish of the wheel completely changes the look um, and kind of style that it, it presents when you put it on the truck or car. You can really change up the look of the wheel once you apply different finishes and you have that option with the custom built billet wheels. On a one piece wheel, it is, it is what you get. It either comes in black or charcoal or polished or sometimes just one finish at all. So many different options and finishes on a billet wheel.